But after Koile High School, um, you are attached to re-education and coming to... Uh, after Koile High School, um, I, I, there is one school I really wanted to go for higher. Friends come singer. Mm -hmm. Out of blues, I really loved that school. That's for and the A-levels. That's for the A-levels. Mm -hmm. But what happened actually when I was actually in form, form, form towards Form 3, uh, I was actually a person of literature, history, and still art subjects. Mm -hmm. But there's this, 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 this other bully also. You know, like every other time I was entering into a literature class, he would say, Kaka, are you, a, are you a girl? Why are you doing literature? So he kind of like convinced me to go science subject. And, and by science subject, I was actually very poor. So out of that, because I never did literature then, mm -hmm. I missed one or two points. So I was not able to join Friends Come Singer. And I was actually very, very disappointed. So when I came to Nairobi from the village, and of course I came staying with my cousins, my uncles here in Nairobi, I really wanted to further my education. See, like either uh, do that particular subject in literature, because I was very good in literature. Mm -hmm. I wanted to repeat that particular subject and then kind of like get a chance to, to join a, a polytechnic, a, say for A-levels, because my cousin, most of my cousins actually went to polytechnic for, for A-levels. But it was never paid to me. A little alone, I joined the extra media studies at the University of Nairobi. I studied diploma in marketing. And out of that process now, I was able to get some Kibaru here as an artist. Uh -huh. And uh, out of blues, I was taken to a station called uh, Radio Operations, where I started doing kind of like clerical work. I remember, you see, like, the station used to open at 6. Yes, Kufungua so, Kituo. Kufungua Kituo. So there, there's, there's this log that, that I was taught how to kind of like sedge you. You are a newsreader. Uh, yes, I was a newsreader. Yes. 